Hello everybody, it's been a while since I've done a YouTube video for a how-to. In fact, the YouTube video, my apologies, I've been very busy with work, but things are slowing down and then it'll pick back up here in just a little bit. This video was based off of a very, very interesting um, article on, let me see if I have the URL now. It was based off of, um, that's right, tesotechmint.com. Linux how-to guides, and they had an article I got an, uh, an email on on YouTube Downloader, or YouTube hyphen DL, uh, that we're used to in the Linux world. Now, I bring this up because many of us have used or seen YouTube Downloaders on the interwebs, uh, such as YouTube Downloader for Windows. However, it comes so much junkware and bloatware, and possibly even malware if you let your if you get crazy with all the install plugs on that sucker or click on the wrong thing on the website. So I said, well, how's a nice, faster, command line driven way just to do things safely? And I found a YouTube downloader on an article. So I thought I would just share it with the masses and hopefully you guys enjoy this video. So pop open your favorite flavor of uh, Linux distro, whether it be CentOS, Ubuntu, or etc. And you're just going to pop open a terminal like I have here and you're just going to do sudo apt get install YouTube downloader type in your password I've already installed it so it should say I've already been installed yeah so very good and if you want and I suggest you do this go to YouTube uh, tac DL tac tac help and you can see all the different lists of commands that you have at your fingertips now uh, a good uh, one to do so we'll go ahead and clear this out and we'll just do YouTube and then do tac tac say list hyphen or tac formats for mats and then we're just gonna say this particular YouTube video right here and we're going to say paste okay so it shows you all the current uh, videos you have to use and uh, what's the best one they give you. And if there's 1080p available, there's not any on here. The only highest best quality we can get is the 720p. Now there may be an issue with here. I've noticed that when you have a warning static signature algorithm set up for a specific link, sometimes it doesn't download. Um, I think it's there for protection. You'll get a 403 error. So. We'll, we'll try it out here. Let's see. YouTube downloaded attack attack F, and we'll say 136. Oh yeah. Got to provide a URL, otherwise it doesn't know where to go. Yeah. So this is a good example. So um, in this case, you may get a 403 error, uh, falling back to static signature algorithm. Certain YouTube videos are kind of blocked in regards to this. There is a way to get around it, and I will show you here right now. Alright, here's another uh, song that I like, and as you saw, there's no warning. So it just really depends on the video. Um, I'll show it to you here in a little bit. I just want to show you how do you actually use the YouTube downloader. So YouTube downloader, and then we're going to say tac, 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 f. And 480 is fine. So we'll say 135. And then the URL of the thing I want to listen to or download. And there it goes. Even told you what it was and what I downloaded and how big the file size is. You can find it if you just ls, it puts it right there. Or if you just go to your archive manager, and there it is and it downloaded it just fine yeah I, I didn't download a actual video on here but what I can do is this uh, let's quit this and we can um, copy this and move it to here of course VMware is going to have some issues with it but there it is BAM so now I just copied it onto my Windows device and I don't want to play the sound or audio output too much for you so I don't get in trouble but yeah and I can hear it just fine too so very cool uh, easy enough right I'll just delete the file it was just an example to show you uh, 
pretty cool. There's so many tools you can use uh, in regards to a YouTube downloader, but I would suggest doing this one as far as a safe download to go, because you're not going to get a whole bunch of uh, things you don't want to see, hear, or look at. Um, if you do go this route, I would definitely suggest looking at the help file. Um, there's another nifty trick you can use here. Uh, list extractor. So YouTube hyphen or YouTube tack DL space tack tack list tack extractors, and it shows you all the different things you can look at uh, and download from. Unfortunately, it does have porn sites here as well, um, but it has Vimo, which is pretty cool, and uh, I think there's some yeah tech talks which I liked right. Uh, you have some. What else do we have here? Yeah, pretty much anything you can think of. I mean, that's just a lot of. That's a lot. Uh, a lot of stuff you can download uh, from the stream, and it works just like wget. So um, there's a pretty cool article. Like I said, look at techmint.com and find this article on it. And if you want to learn more, but for the time being, I showed you how to download a YouTube video. If you run across that error. I would suggest just for the time being is just Google it how to get around the 403 uh, mm, algorithm error when you do YouTube video um, uh, as an example that one which is falling back to static signature algorithm unable to download video data HTTP error 403 forbidden so something is catching it and is causing it to do a uh, so there's a tra trace back on that Python script that we're using which is what this is and uh, anyway, just take a look at it. Let me. I'm curious on your guys' input. Comment on the video if it was instructional. Instru I hope this was instructional. Blah, blah blah. Wow. Today is Tuesday, and it feels very weird. I want to thank you all for viewing. It's hopefully it's been an instructional video for y'all, and um, hopefully it'll be a safe video for you guys to use and to download YouTube videos in a safe manner without getting a bunch of junk or bloatware. All right, take care.